Have you heard of this song? It's called If I Can Stop One Heart From Breaking by Robin. Her songs are played in the dreamland from time to time as the Charmony Festival is drawing close. This spot is the closest place to the sky in the dreamscape. It's far away from the hustle and bustle of the city and free from the bickering among the dreamers. You can feel the moment. The scenery, the people and the dreams. Without being disturbed by anyone. How beautiful. <laughs> Time is frozen at this golden hour. This golden dream shared by the fool from the tavern and the memo keeper from the Garden of Recollection, the wandering ranger and the IPC ambassador, the Astral Express nameless, and me. Everyone falls asleep here equally, regardless of our different agendas. <sighs> I'm sorry. I really am a stowaway. I think it's only right to tell you. My hometown was destroyed a long time ago. <laughs> it was probably the doing of the Legion or the Swarm, but... I'm an interstellar refugee. Just like... Many of the Penacone locals. The Harmony accepts everyone, including wanderers from afar. Family takes them in, but they don't belong here. In this splendid metropolis, some have a dream called Penacone, but some have dreams. different from reality. Even though everyone who comes here harbors the same motive in the beginning. And it's likewise for me. I have a wish I want to achieve so badly in the real world. But I can't. So, I want to give it a shot here. Entropy loss syndrome. Have you heard of this term? It's a strange condition. Those suffering from it will experience an irreversible chronic dissociation of their physical structure. This means they will slowly fade away. The process is barely noticeable to others. You can still run, jump, and talk as usual. Everything seems normal. But then you'll start doing everything slightly slower than others. And then even slower than that. Until the lines between your body and the entire world become blurry. You won't be able to tell reality from dreams because they've all been shattered. So how can I possibly resist it? I mean, can you imagine? I can actually free myself from this icy medical cabin in this dream. I can forget about all the doctor's advice. I can listen and see and touch and think and understand whatever I want with my body. So although this world is real, this experience is priceless. Just like
like this moment. Shackles, one feathers my face. I'm sorry. For certain reasons, there are things I can't reveal to you yet. Leave me. But there are also things you should know. I am. In fact, after the Watchmaker's legacy. But that doesn't mean we have to go our separate ways and be enemies. But at least... I really hope things don't turn out that way. Thanks. In my dream, I saw a scorched earth and a new sapling emerging from it. It bloomed against the morning sun and it whispered to me. I still remember the question on the invitation letter. Why does life slumber? You see, everything is possible in this land of dreams. The nightmarish past will disperse and fade away like bubbles in water. And the future that you don't want to face will never come. Why do people choose to sleep? I think... It's because they're afraid to wake up from the dream. I'm sorry. Things are getting all bleak and serious. Uh, let me see what I can do to lighten the mood. I mean, don't you have a lot of friends at the Astral Express? What would you guys do if something like this happened? Spray can? That's... Rough. Perhaps there's something else we can do? Jokes. Oh, I, I don't really have a good sense of humor. Perhaps we can think of another way? Coffee? Well, we can't really make that here. Aren't there other crew members we can take inspiration from? been trying to do that but I think I failed maybe there are other things that you guys do selfie selfie hmm you're right I mean I've been here so many times why didn't I think of taking a photo I feel a little awkward taking it by myself would you like to join me Let's commemorate this moment. I can be a little bit camera shy. <laughs> Just don't laugh at me. Here, you hold the camera. Soaring past the night to trace the primal light. Wait, let's get ready. I'm good. Let's do this. One, two. Already? <laughs> Time really flies. I feel like going back to reality and resting too. Come on, let's say goodbye at Golden Hour. <laughs> 